Alrighty, let's get this started. Um, I'm not too good at, I'm not too good at uh, intros, but I'm not even gonna start. Let's just get into it. So bright. Unintentionally, I turn my eyes upward and see a wide open blue sky and an overly assertive sun. I lift my right hand and shield and shield my eyes from the relent- relentless assault of sunlight. I love the night that's been sacrificed, is being scorched and teased. I wish this. I wish the sun would show its mercy. Ah, I wish the sun would explode. Sakurako. <laughs> I hope so. Yeah, I know. I don't know everything. At most, your measurements. Oh, and your weight is 50... You dropped your form after the last physical exam, didn't you? So I put it up on a bulletin board for you. You can thank me now. <laughs> I'm joking. I wrote down the measurements for my files and gave the form to a school nurse. So don't worry. <laughs> eh? Nothing. If that was okay with Sakurako, it's all good. The girl started. The girl starting to walk after me. The previous comedy, Sakurako Tomiyoji, a classmate. I've known her for a long time, but she's not my childhood friend. She's what you'd call a very close one, though. Oh, that reminds me, Sakurako. Nani? <laughs> you wish. Okay, I don't even know you. The sun already ex- exploded, so it's not even dangerous. You should have pointed that part out when you butted in on my light. You need to work on that. We walk together to the gate and leave school. The school ground is filled with the noise of athletic club members. I don't belong to any after school activity, so my impression is that they're practically really hard. Oh, practicing really hard. Meanwhile, soccer ball rolls towards me and stops it with my foot. Alright. I turn to the voice and see a soccer ball member who is one of my classmates. He must have missed kicked. To return it, I make a short run and kick the ball dead center. Oh, Jesus, how hard did I kick it? The ball maintains its low height, passes by the classmate like a bullet, and pierces the gold net on the opposite side of the field. Aww. The 
trick does that mean? I don't know what she's talking about. The more seriously, the more seriously, almost all the soccer club members are looking at us, wondering what, what has just happened. I'll go ahead. I escaped through the school gate and let out a big sigh. Now I've really done it. I can't believe I can't control it this much. I thought I could manage it. This is exactly what she said. After all, I... Ooh, how did I change? Tell me. Huh? What are you saying? I haven't changed. Huh? <laughs> it sounds like me. One month ago, my mother died. It was so sudden, I wasn't sure what was really happening to me back then. For a few days, I was so depressed that I didn't feel like doing anything. I worried and troubled many people. Sakuraku was one of them. I see. It was only a month ago, and intentionally put my hand on my chest. Yeah, you should be sorry. God. Sakura must be mistaken my gesture for remembering my mother and getting depressed. She looks worried and makes an apology. No, I've come to terms with it, it's, so it's okay. More than that, I'm surprised to know it was just a month ago. So many things have happened since, since then. I tell her to Sakuraku who is concerned and shrug my shoulders. そうだよね。元気に乗ってきたかなって思ってたとたん。学園を休む日さ。風かと思って様子見に行ったらもう抜けの殻でしょ。馬鹿なこと考えてるんじゃって思って捜索願い出そうか。本気で悩んだから。あ
I'm h o u s e i s t h i s the girl she was talking about? A maid. Undoubtedly, she is a maid. Faced with the, this out of place maid in the house where only my mother and I lived not so long ago, I'm forced to realize my life has changed whether I like it or not. On the day I met this girl in front of me, I was forced to give up being a human. Oh, God. The smell of dust and the feeling of cold stones. What's under my cheek? Is this flagstone or just hard floor? <laughs> my sense of smell is overwhelmed by an incredibly old and stale odor. I can easily imagine that no human hands have taken care of this place for many years. At least the time passes far longer than I can comprehend. I feel certain of that. What is this place? After much determination, I'm able to slightly open my eyes. I see an outdated and dreary corridor as, she, as should be expected. I think so. I mean, I just got home. Huh? Oh, wait. Never mind. I think I just woke up in the sewer or something. I can't organize myself. Where am I? Who is the girl in front of me? Why is she a maid? Oh my god! I'm gonna go to the sewer! Huh? No, wait, wait, please wait! <laughs> oh god, she's dragging me. She's dragging me, guys. <laughs> so bad on my back. <laughs> What? The girl starts walking without listening to me. She grips in her. In her hand, something that looks like a leash and it's connected to the thing tied around my body. Stop! Stop! Please stop, please! After dragging me for dozens of meters on the floor, she finally stops. The floor is uneven and hurts. I could stand up and walk by myself, so wait a second. She'll literally just give me a second. Tied up only a Above the elbows, I managed to stand up by myself. Th thank you. You helped me. No, no. Why am I tied up? And who are you? Where am I? No, I didn't. Huh? I wasn't asking for those. But if you tell me. Why, why would I say that? Why? Why would you say that? <laughs> Don't pull that. I'm gonna fall down and I don't really care about their size. Rather, I prefer modest ones. <laughs> Wait, I can't allow you to call me a lollicon, but I promise my mother. But if you suddenly stop, like, stop, like, I don't know what to do. Eh? Uh, well, I'm Shuma Kusanagi. She's gonna drag me again. Pull, pull. <laughs> no, no, untie me first. <laughs> Why are you acting like a dog? <laughs> She's dragging us again. Hi, <laughs> Tochakuri! She finally stopped. How dare she drag me around while humming a tune? I quit resisting and kept my face off the floor to avoid getting scraped, but now my neck really hurts and I'm close to losing my patience. Hey, enough of this. Untie me now or you will be sorry later. Not only do I not know where I am, but it, I'm also tied up and can't move. I understand it's not constructive to lose my calm in this stupid way right now, but I can't help being irritated. It's time to give her a clear no, just when I've decided I feel the surrounding air has been transformed. Oh god. <laughs> Fear runs through my spine as if icy water had been splashed down my neck. <laughs> Before I know it, she's dragged me through the corridor, now we're in a wide open space. This place, I should call it a throne room, is dimly lit and filled with gloomy air. And I feel a diff a different wait. And I feel a different presence from the girl called Mari who dragged me here. I turn my head in that direction. Oh god, what is behind us? <laughs> what is this? That is... That is it, right there. It sits on the throne, resting a cheek in one hand and glaring at me. On the outside is a cute girl, like an angel. But my instinct tells me something is not right. Like a frog being stared down by a snake. This phrase passes through my mind. 
I want to scream and run away right now, but my body is frozen. The maid who dragged me here looks nervous. Her facial expression is tense. She seems to be trembling slightly. I too can't stop my trembling. The back of my neck tingles and feels like my hair is standing on end. It's so hard to breathe. Maybe on TV. Vampires? I try my not I try my best not to go blank from fear and gasp for the word. The girl grins as enjoying my reaction. So this, this music is creepy. The smug faced girl in front of me could be dismissed as pathetically delusional, but unusual pressure released from her commands me to think otherwise. But prognators, vampire blood, my mother was a normal human being. As far back as I can remember, I was alone with my mother. That was my normal life, so I never had any doubts, nor did my mother say anything about it. Probably your father was freaking Dracula. <laughs> oh god. You say that so out of the blue. Oh, we don't really know our father, so... Surprised? I am surprised to find out that, I, that the father I forgot existed is actually a vampire and... A disgusting raping bastard. I'm more angry than surprised, even if he is my root, he did it too. No wonder my mother didn't tell me of his existence. Shit. When I see him, I'm gonna beat him up. <laughs> Don't freaking laugh like that. What? <笑>主張と奥方様はそれはもう仲睦まじかったですよ。え? <笑> What is this? I don't understand what she's talking about. What? Does this mean? I jumped to the wrong conclusion. Oh no, this is really embarrassing. But then why was my mother alone? According to the maid right there, they were in love, weren't they? After saying that, the maid turned her eyes to the girl with twin twins as if to ascertain her reaction. He was a vampire, but died? What? Didn't that girl with twin tails just say smugly that immortal blood crosses over time eternal? <laughs> oh god, my heart. No, I thought I was used to it a little, but whenever she turns her eyes to me, my body shrinks up as if my heart were clutched by her hand. She's probably doing that. それも始祖の力を宿した方はそれこそノーライフキングの異名を得るほどの時を過ごされます。Seriously? She's over 2000 years old and looks like this? I can't let call her a legal lolly. This is a lolly old bag. No, my instinct is whispering to me to say no more. 
それぞれ思想を頂点にしてバランスをとってきていました私のお使いしているアンドロシェケも始祖である師女を筆頭に平穏な日々を過ごしていたのですが<笑> What is between them as far as I can tell it seems the maid belongs to a different family from this lolly old bat I mean blonde twin tails girl 残念ながら<笑>師女は帰らぬ身となりアンドロシェケの多くの眷属たちもまた市場が消滅してしまったことで存在することができなくなってそれで私はアンドロシェケ最高のためトミラ様に協力していたのですここに来れば新たなご主人様に会えると聞きましたのでえ you mean me? ですね I'm the master of the maid in front of me Considering everything you've treated me really badly, I have not forgotten you dragged me here. I'm still tied up. It's about time to untie me. To you, I did them all. Tato, I know, Kata no go, she so good to a ye. You get to them on I cut on me. How dare you? She's some at all. Could it put you more, my mother? She. All right, I don't remember being a vampire in the slightest. <laughs> 人間が拘束されて床に転がされているどうですか今どんな気持ちですかえいえい What is she doing to me? Are you kicking me? Hey hey just because I can't resist don't don't start poking me with your toe I'm gonna peek I'm gonna peek up your panties Dude why are you saying this? They're going to kill you へへへやれるものならやってみてくださいどんどんどんどんどんどんどんどんどんどんどんどんどんどんどんどんどんどんどんどんどんどんどんどんどんどんどんどんどんどんどんどんどんどんどんどんどんどんどんどんどんどんどんどんどんどんどんどんどんどんどんどんどんどんどんどんどんどんどんどんどんどんどんどんどんどんどんどんどんどんどんどんどんどんどんどんどんどんどんどんどんどんどんどんどんどんどんどんどんどんどんどんどんどんどんどんどんどんそれにまた横槍を入れられてもつまらんからな。Think she has like three gray hairs in front of her face. Draw? The frick does that mean? All the, girl, all the girl does is move her fingers to beckon me. It's only that my body laying on the floor moves in front of her. My feet are hovering above the ground. そこの犬が言ったようにお前の父親は死んだ。だが。それでは困るのだ The girl stretches out her arm, the maid's face turns white and she backs away. I want to do the same, but my body refuses to listen. あやつはお前を人間として過ごさせたかったようだが、今となってはそれはかなわぬこと。I can't take my eyes off the dim light gathering on her fingertips. All I know is that its existence is indefinable. さあ。手きの因子を与えてやる時代の始祖となり私のもとへ来い Why do you have to talk like that? アンブロシェ I don't want to Her arm slowly stretches towards my stomach 目覚めろ、oh、Ah! She stabbed me! Her thin arm is embedded within me Ah! 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 感じろお前の中にある力を Am I really saying this? My body is burning, my blood feels like it's boiling. <laughs> I've died. I told you, dude. This is what happens. The girl is saying something, but I have no time to hear it. I don't know how to describe this. I don't even know if it's painful or exhausting. It's simply hot. My body is being transformed. What, what is this? I woke up and found a rope around my body. I was dragged around by the maid. The twin tailed blonde girl totally looked down on me and suddenly told me I have vampire blood in me. Still, I have no idea what's going on. This can't be! 
Suddenly, an eye-burning flash appears. The heat that has been eating up my body begins to calm down. Instead, now I feel a gentle warmth in my chest. Isoma. I surrender my body to the loose light. Right in front of me, Mary the maid anxiously looks up at me. No, nothing, just... Alright, please tell me what happened at that time again. After Iris put her hand into my stomach. Mary gives a look as if, if to say again. Well, it's true, I asked her many times before. <laughs> Just tell me. The flashback was so vivid that I can't help being emotional. Right. Mari says this and then walks to the kitchen. She's going to prepare tea just like she said she would. I drag my feet to my room. There's probably someone there. <sighs> In my room, I drop my bag and change out of my school uniform. When I get to the living room, tea is waiting for me, so I have it with thanks. I feel my mind clearing up a little. Green tea is good. No, it's not. It's nasty. The girl I made clothes sitting across from me is Maritama Makomia? As she, as she just suggested, I call her Mary. Her whole name is not easy to say, so frankly, it's helpful. Yeah, I'm even having trouble. Right, Iris gave me a stomach bam. Not wrong, but not quite right. And after that, I don't have any memories. Right. The place I was abducted to is a small country called Rakronia in Eastern Europe. From there across the ocean is to Japan. My memories are completely blank. I became a star! I became a star, guys. Did that expression take your fancy? No, don't pay attention. If you do, I lose. I kind of remember the light covered me up after that. <laughs> I bet she liked it. It's about me, but I don't understand what this all means. I can guess what you want to do, but you're ready for what comes after, aren't you? I crack my knuckles. Oh, I must have been wrong. That is really roughly, and we obviously smuggled ourselves in. <laughs> what? You guys are vampires. Couldn't you guys transform and fly away? That's true, no passport, no foreign currencies, no connections. The maid I had looks dependable, but it's useless. In this situation, I transferred from one ship to another and smuggled myself back to Japan. So she said, and I did it in an unbelievably short time. Honestly, I cannot believe the story. It makes more sense to think the maid before me is telling a lie. But even if it's a lie, in reality, I, we escaped from the old castle and came back to Japan. This is really creepy. What? That's the thing. Me escaping from Macronia and coming back to Japan was not really me. Normally, yes. You said the other me was dependable. You see. Right. 
どっちでもいいとしか答えられませんよなぜなら私はメイドでご主人様はアンブロシェ家の当主吸血鬼なんですからヴァンパイア Right, that time I was turned into a vampire by the hand of that twin tailed girl. No, I haven't sucked blood yet, so I'm human. Are you serious? Did, you, did she just really say that? <laughs> oh my freaking god. Okay, I'm just gonna end it right here because that, that just did it for me, guys. That's. No, no. D don't even look at it, guys. C close your eyes. And look away, just no. But yeah, I'm ending it right here, guys. Um, I hope to see you guys in the next video. Hope you guys were liking this. The beginning, I think we're still in the prologue. I'm not too sure. This is the first time playing, but yeah. I'll see you guys later, guys. And you guys take care. Later, guys.